I don't think people in Hollywood are very happy with this reaction to a show I think they thought was going to do really, really well. Instead, it looks like everybody's pretty united on how they feel about it. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm, of course, talking about the latest failure from Hollywood called MILF Manor. This is a very, very strange and disgusting show. <laughs> I was somewhat curious when I first heard about it, and then I saw a little bit of, I think, the first episode, and I dipped out. We're going to get into that in a second, but I just want to show you how it's doing on the critic sites. So over on Rotten Tomatoes, Milf Manor, as you can see, sitting at 17% with critics and an audience score of 22%. Thank God. I was wondering how where this would land because the show is very degenerate and disgusting. And if this show had just been about a bunch of older women with younger men running around in a, in a, in a house, it'd be like, whatever. But the twist on the show is what is, I think pretty damn disgusting. And I'm going to, I'm going to go over that with you in a second. So we can go over to IMDb, and you can see right here that it's at 2.9 out of 10. Nobody likes this show. In fact, a lot of people are pretty disgusted by it. Now, we're going to get how many episodes of this? I don't know if it says here. Six. MILF told me not to come. MILF, I'm a big boy now. She's a bad MILF jamma. Your MILF don't dance. Your MILF should know. And MILF said, knock you out. A play on Mama Said Knock You Out. A great song by LL Cool J. So, we'll look at some of those in a second. Some of the reviews. <laughs> did anybody give this a good review? Oh, <laughs> one did. <laughs> From the Daily Beast, of course. <laughs> From the Daily Beast. Once Milf Manor is able to learn, lean into the cheese factor while also adding a fun, spirited host and a clear-cut focus, we'll all be thanking, we'll all be thanking Thirty Rock for accidentally inspiring such a brilliant television show. By the way, I don't know what channel this is on. I think it's on USA. Every time I look up, it says "Go buy it on Amazon," so you pay for it. You don't get it for free. So I don't know where exactly you watch this. One out, like even here, where to watch? Voodoo, Prime Video, Apple TV. I saw one outlet say it was on USA. I don't know where you can watch this show. If you want to watch this show, I don't recommend it. But this is what I got disgusted by, and I think a lot of people are. So the twist on this show is that it's not just a bunch of young men. The sons of the women are there. So a mother has to watch her son run around. And where I turned this off was the first mini game where one of the mothers, and this is this is where people are, are disgusted. So one of the mothers has to wear a blindfold and go up and rub all of the abs of the of the guys and figure out which one is her, her son. What the hell is this? First off, who would who would do this, even for a lot of fame? This is gross. Personally, and this is my opinion, it would all be legal, anyone over 18, but I, I think it's immoral. But I'm not here to debate it. If you have children that are over 18, right, I think you should probably cut off <laughs> the age that you would pursue, you know, around your children's age. That's weird to me. Like, if I had an 18-year-old, I would never probably want to hook up with someone around that age. It's just weird. And, like, the fact that these women all have children the same age 
as these contestants, I think, is strange. It's just my opinion. I don't know how many people share it, but that's how I feel about it. I think it's weird. So MILF Manor viewers claim Demented Show is weird mix of philia and grooming. The twist is that they are dating each other's sons. Everyone is going straight to hell. Eight women will be dating from a pool of men, which includes each other's sons. One of the disturbing scenes, a contestant is and her son talk about her boobs. The moms are blindfolded and had touched bodies of young men in a test. And they end up touching their own kids. It's weird and gross. This is disgusting. Try to like it, it feels like they're trying to normalize some weird shit with this show. And the show could have been funny, but this mix of adding your own kids into the show is disgusting to me. I think it's really weird, and it's typical Hollywood degeneracy. We can take a look at some of the people here that are on the show. Meet the mother and son duos of Milf Manor. A reality series where contestants date alongside their family family members. I thought this show was fake. I can't believe this is a real show. I remember when I first heard about this show. Not that long ago. It was a couple of weeks ago. People were talking about, I, this is fake. This is a not real show. And it turns a very real show. <laughs> this is a real show. So here's a combo. This is mom and son. Here's a combo. Here's a combo. I'm sure he'll be quite popular. Here's a combo. A lot of plastic surgery there on the left. There's a combo. There's a combo. There's one, too. There's another one. I think that's it. So these are the contestants. Uh, I'm not going to watch any more of this show. I don't even think I'm going to cover any more of this show unless for some reason it blows up in the ratings, uh, which would be funny because it seems that most people hate it. We can take a look at what some of the people are saying about it. This is just from the critics. It might be a new low for reality TV, perhaps even rock bottom. On a societal level, and for a number of reasons, MILF Manor is a deeply distressing series. Two reviews from the Daily Beast. Uh, this one from the Daily Beast actually sums it up pretty well. And then another person from the Daily Beast gives it a high score. How does the Daily Beast get two entries on this list, by the way? What is that? Why do they get two entries? Rolling Stone hates it. Cider hates it. How many critics reviewed this series? Six. It'd be interesting to see how that changes as more review it. Uh, cr uh, audiences don't like it. Wow, what a car wreck. How, do, how low do these shows need to go? This is the reason why we should never go to another Hollywood movie. Hollywood is degraded so far down. I just don't have the words. Man, this show is going to ruin some of those families, and the stuff I saw is anything to go by. I mean, one lady sleeping with her son's best friend. Yikes. Faith in humanity lost. Disgusting television. This is so degenerate, disgusting, and affront to any and all morals. I must see more. This guy gives it five stars. Oh, six stars. No, five stars. Can our country get any lower or classless? I watched for a few minutes disgusting concept with their sons there. Whoever thought of this has major issues. Moms will never watch this show. So most people seem to hate it. Though we'll see as more people watch it, wherever you even watch it. This doesn't even say. This looks like you have to purchase this show to watch it. I wonder if that's true. Apple T Is it on Apple TV? Can someone in the comments clear this up for me? And I'm sure somebody will. I saw USA. I didn't even know that was still a network. But then I come over here and it says Voodoo, Prime Video, and Apple TV. So I'm not sure. Let me know in the comments where this is located if anybody wants to watch it. Anyway, give me your general thoughts on this, if you would. Also, please like, subscribe, share the video. Make sure you're still subscribed to that notification bell. Check out my locals and my rumble. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Make sure to check out my locals. There's a link in the description. 
It's a fun community that I'm trying to build over here. If you don't want to support me on YouTube, you can come over here. None of that money goes to YouTube. You also can just come over here for free. But if you are a supporter over here, I do plan on doing an extra live stream once a month and throwing links to the supporters so you can actually come on and have a supporter live stream with me. Also, it's a good place to catch all of my content. You don't have to worry about notifications like YouTube. They'll definitely work over here. So come check out my locals.